Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this tutorial, we will discuss Amazon Q Developer, which is a powerful conversational AI assistant that can significantly enhance your productivity when working with AWS services and resources. In this video, I'll walk you through the process of installing the Amazon Q Developer command line interface, or CLI, on a Linux machine and then show you how to use it for a variety of tasks from chatting AWS services to asking questions that are related to my AWS account using natural language. Let's dive in and get you set up in a Linux terminal. The first step is to download the appropriate installation file for your Linux system using curl command. Once the download is complete, unzip the package and run the install script. When prompt with, do you want Q to modify your shell config? Choose yes to let the Q make the change for you. Next, for login method, you can choose use for free with builder ID. Now, the terminal will show you a URL with a user code. Copy the URL and open a browser. In the browser, paste the URL. It will show an authorization request page with a temporary user code. Choose confirm and continue. Then choose allow access on the next page. Now in the Linux terminal, you will see that the authentication succeeded. You have grant the QCLI access with your free Amazon Builder ID. In some cases, you may need to log into your Builder ID in the browser first. Okay, now that we have the Q Developer CLI installed, let's see it in action. To launch the CLI, simply type QChat in your terminal. You'll be greeted with the CLI prompt. Let's first issue and model CLI command to list the available large language models available. In my environment, I see a list of anthropic Claude models, and I will choose to use the Claude 3.7 sonnet model for my chat. Next, I'm going to ask a question to Q. What is Amazon Q Developer CLI? Q will analyze my question and provide the relevant information directly in the terminal. The Q Developer CLI can do much more than just chatting. Let's try to ask about EC2 instances in your AWS account. You can simply type, list all EC2 instances in my account. Q will understand your request and list the EC2 instances information for you by calling AWS CLI API. No need to navigate to the EC2 console or run complex AWS CLI commands just use natural language with QCLI. Well, there you have it. You're now equipped with the knowledge to install and start using the Amazon Q Developer CLI on your Linux machine. This powerful tool can dramatically improve your productivity when working with AWS, providing a natural language interface to get answers, generate code, and automate common tasks. I encourage you to continue exploring the Q Developer CLI and its various features. The more you use it, the more you'll discover how it can enhance your AWS workflows. And remember, the Q Developer is constantly expanding its capabilities, so be sure to check for updates and new features over time. For those who want to dive deeper, I've included a link in the video description to the official AWS user guide on Amazon Q Developer CLI. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel for more AWS tutorials. Also, let me know in the comments below what other AWS services you'd like to learn more about. Thanks for watching.